Hello friends, I am Naveena from Hyderabad. So, I am right now in 4th year of MBBS. So we know we have different subjects in our med medical curriculum. Those include anatomy, physiology, biochemistry and so on and so forth. So among all these subjects, from our first year, everything gets repeated. You know, what we learn in anatomy, physiology, biochemistry, that implies to pathology and pharmacology and microbiology. Pathology, pharmacology, microbiology are again repeated in medicine surgery. The only difference in medicine surgery is the treatment part, which is extra when compared to pathology, pharmacology and microbiology, right? So all the subject, all the medic medicine subject is just modification of the same concept. So I believe in teaching system wise rather than teaching all these some 10, 15 to 20 subjects. So all these subjects, if you see, I have grouped them in two groups. Anatomy, Physiology, Biochemistry, Patho, Pharmacology, Microbiology, Medicine, Surgery, Pediatrics, Community Medicine. All these subjects have something in similar. Most of the topics will be in similar, are in similar in each subject. So now I am going to teach these subjects in a different way. I am not going to go through subject wise but I would like to go through the system wise. Has gastrointestinal system, renal, respiratory, CVS, CNS, endocrine, bone and mineral disease, metabolic disease, genetic disease, genetics, connective tissue and other diseases. So all these from, G, from starting with GIT, I will deal with each of the disease, with each of the system, anatomy and then physiology of the system and then what are the biochemical aspects which should be dealt in this system and then what are the pathological aspects and what are the microbiological aspects which are important and then medical, surgical and pediatrics aspects according to each system wise. So that makes your work easier and simpler and even concise when compared to reading uh, many subjects like this. So at the end I will also deal with obstetrics, ENT, ophthalmology and forensics separately because these are a little different topics when compared to the others. So guys, uh, I will try to upload at least one video per day or four to five videos per week. So please subscribe the channel and I would like to do my best uh, through these videos. Thank you.